Hello, creatures! I gotta say, it is great to be back here on Impact. You guys, you've always been here for me. Thank you so much. And going forward, I guarantee, I promise that I will always be here for you. And with that said, I think it's about time to set my sights on that world title. Here it's Jared? some balls around here needs to go out there and put you in your place. And you know what? I think we all know I've got the biggest set here. Yeah. Yeah. You think you think you're a man? You think you're going to walk in here with your little puppy dog eyes and beg everybody for forgiveness? Oh, forgive me. You think that's what a man is? Is that what a man is? And let me make one, look at me when I'm talking to you. One more thing, perfectly clear. I'm not out here to fight Jeff Jarrett's battles. My husband, unlike you, can do that all on his own because he's the one that wears the pants in our family. Jeff, Jeff, are, excuse me? You think, you think being a man is showing up at Turning Point and using your tactics that you use to win the match? Is that what being a man is? Is it? Is it? You want to come out here and thank everybody and you want to be a role model for kids? Well, you know what? You need to step up and you need to be a man first. Look at me! You need to be a man first. Like my husband, the one man in this business that had a big enough set to start a company to give people like you another place to go. Ungrateful, disrespectful, disrespectful wrestlers. That's what you are. And Jeff, are you, are you forgetting one other small detail? That your wife, Beth and I, we were friends. Or should I say, I played the political game and pretended that I was her friend. Oh God, your poor wife, poor Beth. She sat at home all these years while you were on the road. She just couldn't wait for a friend to come into her life that she could just open up to and tell everything to. And there's one little detail that I would love to share with everybody, how you just couldn't quite deliver the goods, how you, how you just couldn't quite complete the deal, Jeff. You know what I'm talking about, right? What, yeah, am I, what, you wanna act stupid? Am I embarrassing you, Jeff, am I? Am I? Am I embarrassing you? You're getting a little red. I mean, we all know you're not a man around. You're not a real man. We all know you're not a real man. So why don't you hit me? Hit me! Drop your microphone and hit me! Hit me! Come on, Jeff, hit me! Huh? Huh? Show everybody what a man you're not! Is she trying to say that I didn't beat her man fairly? You sure as hell didn't beat my man fairly! I am more than a man, Karen. As a matter of fact, I am more 
than human. You okay, okay. and your husband are just two angry bitches. Oh, we've been trying. No, no, no. And we, we are the creatures of the night. We can just sense the aggravation here from. Oh. Jeff Jarrett trying to sneak up from behind on Jeff Hardy. And oh, oh. Well, Karen Jarrett tried the low blow to no avail, but that's the opening for Jeff Jarrett. That momentarily, uh, momentarily distraction of him blocking that low blow was enough for Jarrett. Ooh, whoa, whoa, watch out, though. Here comes Hardy. Hardy explodes off the ropes. Hardy all over Jarrett, just like we saw at Turning Point. Jarrett backs up the ramp. Oh, he wants nothing to do with Jeff Hardy. Could have been a trap, could have been a trap, but the trap didn't work. 